There are billions of planets in the universe, and even to this day the universe itself remains one of the biggest mysteries. Although we are aware there are billions of planets, scientists aren't sure how they form. Even with the vast amounts of planets in our own solar system, scientists still aren't certain how planets are built. So far research and scientists have put forward two theories. The first and most widely accepted theory is the core accretion. However, there are some issues with this theory, and it's thought that it only works with the formation of planets like Earth, but it has problems with giant planets. The second theory is disk instability. This could be a possible explanation for how giant planets are formed. Even to this day, scientists continue to study planets in and out of the solar system in hopes of better understanding them. If you go back 65 million years ago, something must have happened on our planet. It was the KT event. This event is known for the wipeout of the dinosaurs and 70% of all species. However, recent studies have found that it wasn't just North America that got hit. The researchers have discovered that a meteorite hit Greenland. The impact was huge with researchers saying it left behind a crater larger than Paris. After carrying out studies, it was discovered the impact crater was 19.2 miles or 31 kilometers wide under Greenland's ice sheets. This impact has been rated as one of the 25 largest known impact craters on Earth. The team reported the findings in the specialist journal Science Advances. It's interesting to note that never before has such a large crater site been discovered under continental ice sheets. The researchers said the large iron meteorite must have hit this location with some force. One thing that needs to be answered is when the impact actually happened. It's thought the location is in good condition, and from a geological point of view it's thought to be relatively young. Some estimates have suggested it could have happened between 11,500 and 13,000 years ago. It's not uncommon for large meteorites to have an impact on the climate. After the KT event, the planet experienced many geological changes. For example, it's thought that a tsunami buried plants and animals under thick piles of rubble. Due to this, herbivores wasn't able to eat, and this had a knock-on effect which meant the meat-eating dinosaurs wasn't able to eat their normal prey. Lofted debris also darkened skies around the world, and the planet chilled and stayed that way for years. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.